Are you sure no one wants to be my friend? Well, I do. Come sit with me at lunch today. I don't want you to be by yourself. I mean, sure, if you insist. Um, Bailey, why were you just talking to that guy over there? What do you mean? Literally no one likes him. He is so weird. He seems fine to me. I'm just trying to warn you. Oh, please. Warn me about what? Him. But if you don't want to listen to me, fine. Could you tell me how I'm going to die? Uh, yeah, I can. Really? Thank you. I'm just curious. So, uh, what is it? What did I get? Old age. I'm just so glad it's not something bad. Yep. Me next. No, me. Tell me. No, I want to know. Guys, I can't do this. I'm so sorry they all just bombarded you like that. No, it's okay. I figured that was going to happen. I don't even want to know how I die. I can't imagine what it would be. You would do that for me? Of course. Everyone deserves to smile once in a while. It's just that no one else offered. Well, I guess they aren't your real friends then, but I am. I'll give you more under one condition. What condition? You have to sit with me at lunch today and every day. Sure. Don't you dare sit here. We can't have people who are like sad sitting with us. Now shoo. It's honestly so embarrassing that you only got one smile. Guys, cut it out. What are you, fifth graders? You didn't have to do that for me. No, I wanted to. They shouldn't talk to you like that. I know we just met, but I can tell that you're special. You deserve to be happy. You don't have to give me that many. I'd be happy with even like two. Then I would only get to see you smile two times. Infinite? Bailey, I got my power! I can make everyone fall in love with me. That's so cool. What did you get? I haven't gotten anything yet. I'm sure you'll get something cool too. Good morning, honey. Good morning, mom. I'm gonna drive you to school today, okay? Actually, I think I can walk. Are you sure it's far? Yep, I'm sure, bye. I'm so excited for this cruise next week. You can't go. Why? Uh, it was canceled. Oh, really? Uh-huh. That kid never talks to anyone. What a loser. Hey, don't be rude. Maybe there's a reason. Um, who cares? He's weird and smells. Hi. Um, hi? Who are you? Oh, um, I'm Bailey. Why are you talking to me right now? No one ever tries to talk to me. They just leave me. We should be friends. Really? Yes. Everyone, look, the clock is about to strike 12. I'm so nervous to see how many smiles I got. It'll be a lot. You're the happiest person I know. Okay, three, two, one. I got a thousand. What about you? What'd you get? One. Bailey, I I'm so sorry. I mean, maybe it was a mistake, but it'll be okay no matter what. Hey, bestie, how are you? Hey. Oh, are, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Where's that big smile and all the energy that you usually have? Not this year. Richie, you can go have a seat next to Bailey. Welcome. Hey, it's nice to meet you. My name's Richie. What about you? I'm Bailey. Would you want to be friends? I don't have any yet. You should try smiling more. I bet you would look beautiful. I can't smile. Oh. Well, that's okay. I can just give you some of mine. A million dollars? Crazy, right? Your flavor was chosen over a hundred thousand others. All of the funds will be transferred into your account on Monday. Okay. Who did this? So, uh, what are you gonna do with all that prize money you just won? It was you? Surprise! I wanted to make it up to you, so I let you win. I mean, wouldn't there be people who are more deserving than me? I don't think so. You deserve everything and more, Bailey. I know that this is crazy, but please, I just wanted one more chance with you. I don't know, Lucas. I'll do anything. I mean, we're even firing Tate from the company. Firing him? He was never a good employee. I truly just want the best for you. You're beautiful. What? I thought that he was bothering you. Yeah, that doesn't mean that you punch him. So I assume this means you don't want to go on a date anymore? No, definitely not. Could both of you please just leave me alone? 
Wait, just one thing. What, Lucas? Here. I know it's your favorite. Thanks. Excuse me. Yes? Are you Bailey by any chance? Yeah, that's me. Congratulations, you won the contest for the best new flavor. Wait, what? Your entry was chosen to be the winner. But I didn't even enter a flavor. Um, I don't know, there's just one listed under your name. The prize fund is a million dollars, congrats! Huh? My dad owns a large lollipop company. We're trying to find someone to make the best new flavor. Is something wrong? No. Oh, I'm gonna make a chili cheese fries lollipop. That sounds gross. I thought it was a good idea. Sorry. Uh, hey Bailey. Bro, fuck off. Tate, don't. Well, I was just trying to help you. Well, it's not helpful, okay? Do you have any ideas for the contest? Nope, I don't. Really? You don't have a single idea at all? No, I mean it, and I don't want to talk to you, so please, just stop. I mean, are you sure you really should- Ow! You just punched him in the face. He was bothering you. Oh, good morning, Bailey. Good morning, Tate. How are you doing? Why do lollipops keep appearing on your desk every day? Yeah, uh, I don't know. Orange is the worst flavor, at least leave a good one. Enough, it probably was just an accident. Looks like your man didn't show up today, either. He's just a coward. Another one? Give me that. No. Why not? Why are you being protective? No reason, I just really like them. I wanted to ask if you would go on a date with me. A date? Yeah, like dinner or something. Why wouldn't you? You literally ruined my last date. Uh, that's not true. <laughs> I just- Can I have everyone's attention? Hey, um, isn't that guy over there your ex-boyfriend? Yes. Why is he at our school? He doesn't even go here. Maybe he's just dropping someone off. Everyone, please welcome our new student, Ryan. No. Is it a bad thing? You still talk to your exes. That's the problem. He's my only ex that I don't still talk to. Oh, what happened between you guys then? I don't want to bring it up. Oh, Bailey. It's uh, funny to see you here, huh? You know that I go here. Why are you at our school? I had to transfer schools because of my parents' divorce. Whatever, just don't bother me. Wait, I just wanted a second chance with you. You broke my heart. Oh, hey Bailey, good morning. Hey. I'm not ready for this test. Where did these come from? Uh, I don't know, I didn't put them there. They were just sitting on my desk. Maybe you have a secret admirer. Right, that's funny. <laughs> you, uh, you tired? <sighs> yeah, I didn't get much sleep last night. Another? If you're doing this, just tell me now. I'm serious, it's not me. Is there a note? No, they didn't leave anything with it, it's just earrings. I mean, that's kind of weird. And there it is. Hair clips this time. If they want to give you free things, let them. I'm not complaining. We have to be here early for a meeting tomorrow, remember? Yeah, I know, I'll be there. Everyone, please have a seat. Did Emily just put something on my desk? Wait, but you told me you had no idea who he was. I just didn't want to remember him. So you're just gonna lie to me about it then, huh? You abandoned me. That is not the same thing. Yes, it is. And honestly, I think this date is over too. Wait, but I thought that- Don't. <sighs> Work is gonna suck today. Oh, uh, hey, good morning, Bailey. Hey, Tate. Where did this dum-dum come from? I'm not sure. It was just on your desk when I got here. Are you okay? You look a little stunned. No, I'm good. Looks like he didn't even bother showing up to work today. Yeah, I guess so. I'm sorry, I don't think I know you. I have to get going. Are you serious right now? Honey, are you really going on a second date with him? Yeah, what do you mean? I saw how upset you were. Just be careful. Okay. Wow, you look even more stunning than usual. Thank you. I'm really sorry about the first date. I did not mean to. You know what? It's okay. Don't worry about it. 
I never went there again. Funny seeing you guys here. Tate? Sorry for just showing up like this, but I have something to say. Bailey, we were in love in high school. Don't act like you forgot about me. What? It, is that true? What are you talking about? It's just something about you. I feel like I'm in love. I mean, how? We've only spoken like a couple times. I never stopped thinking about you after the day we met. I don't know. I mean... Let me make it up to you. Just give me one more chance. Okay, but this is your last one. Okay, I totally understand that. Hi everyone, we have one more new employee this year, Tate. Are you okay? Um, is something wrong? Um, no, nothing's wrong. So, can I pick you up at 8 tonight for the date? Yeah, yeah. That's a wrap for this week. Everybody enjoy your weekend. Hey, wait! Uh, my name's Tate. I think I know you. Well, I might as well get myself some food on the way home. Alone. Hello, um, is anyone here? I could have sworn it said that they were open on their website. How can I help you? Lucas? That's my name. I'm glad you made it here. Why are you here? I wanted to surprise you at the place we first met. So you let me sit at that restaurant alone for two hours? Uh, what? I, uh, I don't know. I just wanted to surprise you, I guess. What if I didn't show up here? What if I just went home? I'm so sorry. I didn't think about it like that. I'm going home. See you tomorrow. Bailey, I think I'm in love with you. What? Wait, how do you know my first name? I don't think I ever told you that. I know where I know you from now. Well, where is it? Don't leave me hanging. Huh? <gasps> Wait! That was you? You're my favorite customer. I can't believe you didn't remember me. I mean, two years is a pretty long time. You said you could never forget. Usually I don't forget seeing beautiful faces. I don't know why I did. We have to catch up. Are you free for dinner later? Yeah, I'm free for dinner. Okay, great. I'll text you all of the details. How do I look, Mom? You look beautiful, honey. Good luck on your first date. <laughs> Thank you. Hi, how can I help you tonight? Oh, yeah, just a table for two, please. Whatever, he's obviously not showing up. I'm just gonna go home. Well, anyway, my name is Bailey. I go by my middle name, Will. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay, everybody, it's time to get started with the work day. See you later. Yeah, of course. Whoa, did you design that by yourself? Uh, yeah, I did. It's beautiful. You have a lot of talent. Thank you. I appreciate that. Now that I think of it, I definitely remember you from somewhere. I'm sure we'll figure it out at some point. Hopefully. This is gonna bother me for the rest of the day. We were lucky enough today to get a catered lunch for every single one of you. <gasps> they have dum-dums! <laughs> Um, Bailey, is something wrong? Lucas? Morning, sis! Why do you look so happy? Uh, I am happy. <sighs> what is it about this time? I don't know, I'm just like excited to meet my soulmate, I guess. I don't think I've ever seen you in a bad mood. What emotion is he feeling? He's been mad ever since it showed up. Weird, I wonder what it could be. He has to get over it eventually, right? He might just be the opposite of you. Oh, I need to leave. Um, I'll see you later, though. Of course! Okay, cool. We only have two volunteers this year. Is Bailey here? Hi, that's me. Okay, and then the other volunteer today is Tate. Fuck off. Did you just curse at me around children? Um, yeah, I did. And what about it? Okay, bad first impression. Could you just leave me alone? Not really. We're the only two volunteers that came. Are you kidding me? I'm stuck with you. Mm -hmm. Why are you so grumpy? Where's your holiday spirit? I hate the holiday season, and happiness is for suckers. Jeez. Um, do you think you could tell me the new location that he works at? No, I can't disclose that information. Sorry. Could you move if you don't mind? There's people in line behind you. Wait, but what about the free dum-dum with each order? I'm sorry, we don't do that here. I'm never going to be able to find him again. There's like 300 locations just in my area. Are you excited to start your new job today? Yes, I can't wait to meet everyone. You'll be amazing, don't worry. Thanks.
Hi everyone! Welcome to your first day on the job. I'll give you guys a few minutes to get to know your co-workers. Um, excuse me, have we met before? I'm not sure. I don't think so. I'm sorry, it's just that you look really familiar for some reason. Maybe we met before or something. I can take your order when you're ready. Can I just get a number six? Of course. Is that all? Yeah. Uh, we give out a free dum-dum with each order. Thanks. Hey, what can I- Wait, weren't you here yesterday too? You remember me? I don't think I could forget. Let me guess, you want to get a number six. How did you know? I have no idea. It must have been <laughs> luck. And here's your dum-dum. Have a good day. Thank you. Aw, oh, look, it's my favorite customer. Stop, you're making me blush. So, what's your name? If you don't mind that I'm asking. It's Bailey. I don't mind. My name's Lucas. You should try the number one instead. It's my favorite. You know what? Sure. Enjoy the dum-dum and have a good day. You too. I can help who's next? Oh, hi. Where's Lucas? He moved to a different location. He doesn't work here anymore. <laughs> hey, do you want a piece of gum? Oh, sure. Thanks. Hey, would you want to go on a date with me tonight? What? I just think you're beautiful. You literally hate me. What? No, definitely not. Why are you sitting there? What do you mean? Get up and go somewhere else. I always sit here. We're best friends. Yeah, definitely not anymore. You're delusional. What the fuck is going on? On behalf of the entire football team, we would like to perform a song for Bailey. Uh, why did the entire football team just serenade you? You know, I really wish I could answer that, but I'm not sure myself. How's that gum tasting? Um, it just tastes like gum. Why? I was just checking to see if you felt different. What? Uh, nothing. Never mind. What? Bye! <laughs> Girl, you better spit out that gum. It makes everyone who hates you love you, and everyone who loves you hate you. Huh? What is he talking about? I thought you guys met on Tinder. Uh, that's a good question. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Well, spit it out then. I stole him from my mom. What? Oh. Huh. Bitch, that's so weird. Well, they were dating, but he's too young for her anyway. So you're just a homewrecker. Enough. Mary, I dare you to shave all of your hair off. No way, I cannot shave my head. I would be so ugly. Really, bitch? That's your final straw? Bailey, can you chill? What? We're already stuck in here, so you might as well be nice. Fine, whatever. Just do it, and you can have a cute little Britney Spears moment. Fine, I'll do it. You see, that's just not good enough. What? But she did it. Not all the way. Jack, I dare you to jump from the windowsill. No. You can do this, Bailey. I'm sure it can't be that bad. Not her. She's the only one I have left. Good morning, little sis. I brought you some breakfast so you can have it in your bed. You love pancakes. Where's the excitement today? I wish you were never born. What? How could you say that? Seriously? Get out of my room. Fine, whatever. You're such a brat. Nothing could be worse than that. And I was proven wrong. Jesse, I need to tell you something. Yeah, go ahead. You know Matt? Matt as in my crush mm -hmm. Matt? I slept with him. Bailey, what? Why would you do that to me? I'm so sorry. I can't. Literally get out of my face. I don't want to talk to you at all right now. Okay. Can this be over now? What? Guys, that's not funny. Who turned out the lights? Don't look at me. I didn't do it. Since you all think it's fun to play games, let's go for a couple rounds of Dare or Dare. Dude, are we being pranked right now? Wyatt, I dare you to pull out all your eyelashes. Bro, what? That's crazy. No. Don't do it. Someone's just messing with us. Are you sure? <laughs> um, is he dead? Bitch, he definitely does not look alive to me. Now that you all know I'm not kidding, let's continue with the game. Lacey, I dare you to tell everyone the truth. What is he talking about? Um, I was trying to sabotage your relationship with your boyfriend on purpose because I want him. You what? You're supposed to be my best friend. I don't want to be your friend anymore. Bailey, 
It's your turn for a little fun. I dare you to tell everyone how you really met your boyfriend. Oh, please, you know that's not true. Hey, you guys want to play Truth or Dare? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm down too. Okay, Cody, Truth or Dare? Uh, Dare. I dare you to kiss Lacey. Guys, what the fuck? No. Oh, come on, have a little fun. You're not kissing him. He's my boyfriend. Yeah, you want to bet? See, no harm done. No, that's enough of this game for me. I'm leaving. Bailey, wait. What? Why are you being like this? Why would you do that? You knew it was gonna make me mad. It's just a game. It doesn't mean anything. Whatever. Why won't this door open? Maggie, can you please unlock the door? What do you mean? The front door is not locked. Yes, it is. It won't open. What the fuck? None of the doors or windows will open. How would everything be locked? I didn't do it. Yo, what? It just, it won't open. That doesn't make any sense. Who wants to play a game? Please give me invisibility, I look like a rat's ass today. Persuasion. Hey sis. Don't you dare ask me- Yeah, can you drive me to school today? No, I already told you, you embarrass me. You will. Okay, yeah, hop in. Cool. And that's why you can't get it up. You two are fighting again? Oh, when are we not? You should just be in love again, it was so much better that way. I love you so much, honey, fuck the divorce. Hmm. <laughs> I like this. You need to see me after class. You got a 69%. No, I didn't. I got 100%. Wait, what? Did you really? I did. I must have read it wrong. It's 100. Aaron! What's up, slut? We should go on a date. Ew, fuck no. You will take me on a date. I would rather jump off a cliff. What? I want you to take me on a date. And I want to be happy, but we can't all have what we want. Crap. Good mo Did you get another tattoo? No, what are you talking about? Uh, look at your arm. <gasps> what the fuck is that? It's a little dino. You must have had a fun night. I was literally sober last night. That's not possible. Mom's gonna kill me. She told me not to get any more tattoos, and I didn't even know that I got this one. How do you not remember? You look different today. Different how? I don't know. Something's just off. Okay. Here are your tests. Bailey, I need to see you after class. Why? You got a 12%. What? What is going on today? I wake up with a fucking dino on my arm and now everything's going wrong. Girl, I wish I could tell you. Ugh. Guys, I think I just met my soulmate. Soulmates aren't real. Tell that to the tattoo on your arm. What? It's a matching one with your soulmate. Why is someone just telling me this now? Each tattoo has a different meaning, but I guess yours didn't pick a good one. That bitch. Come on, please give me something good. All? What is all? Bailey, guess what? What's up? My gift is mind reading. That's so much cooler than mine. What am I thinking? I wish this stupid bitch would stop talking to me. What do you mean? It's not working on you. Guys, you're gonna be late. We'll figure it out later. Prom tickets are five dollars. Do you think you're gonna go? Probably not. I'm not gonna be able to find a date. I'll be your date! No, no, let me! Me! What? Looks like you won't have a problem finding a date. Yeah, I guess not. I've been in love with you ever since the first day you sat down. Ew, you're my teacher. What? I didn't even say anything. Yes, you did. Jenna, try to use your power on me. Uh, why? Do it. I can see people's biggest fears, but nothing comes up for you. I think th You need to come with us right now. You're such a whore. I'm sorry, what? Mike told everyone what you did. You're a whore. No, he didn't. Fine, you want to play it that way? Everyone hates Mike. Bailey, <laughs> can we talk? Whoa, what happened to your eye? I got punched in the fucking face because of you. Oh, I don't know. I wonder how that happened. <laughs> Literally everyone hates me. I don't know what you're talking about. You know exactly what I mean. Right, okay. Fix it or I'll tell everyone you killed your mom. I didn't even kill my mom. It was the stupid boys. Doesn't matter. I can persuade them. <clears throat> Fix it. No. Yes. No. Do it or I'm gonna snitch on you. Fine. Not everyone hates Mike. That is not what I meant. Everyone loves Mike. See, was that so hard? Whatever. You're the only one who needs to love me now.
Why the fuck would you do that? What? You said you didn't like me. So you steal my girl? Yeah, simple solution. What, are you mad because I can pull her and you can't? You didn't even actually pull her, you used your powers. This is not over, Blondie. Actually, yes it is. You have no chance going up against me. Right. Ugh, I need to go. Bye, I'll tell you how the date goes. Okay, yeah, we'll see about that. Mm -hmm. Okay, Macy should be here soon. So, is the second person coming, or...? I think I got stood up. Whatever. Hey! Mike? That's my name. What the fuck are you doing here? I told Macy not to go out with you. You did what? You don't deserve a date with her after what you did. Well, I actually liked Macy. No, you didn't. You just wanted revenge. You don't know what you just started. I wasn't trying to use my powers with you. I don't know what you mean. Your powers don't work on me. I'm the god of persuasion. Oh, shit. I, I gotta go. Wait, don't go. I'm sorry. What? What is it? It's just, I've had a crush on you for, like, a really long time. Well, that sucks because I like Macy. Wh what? But I thought that... But, but, I don't care. I guess you thought wrong. You better not try any shit like that again. Who said I was planning on it? Yeah, I know you a little too well for that. Just stay in your lane and don't do any more fuck shit, okay? Actually, I have a better idea. Oh, God. I need to leave. I'm gonna be late for class. Hey, bye. Bye. Macy's in love with me. Bailey, I was looking for you. Hey, how are you? I'm so good. Would you want to go on a date? Yeah, I would love to. What the fuck did you just do? I don't know what you're talking about. This is why I don't like you. So are you going to swing back at me or what, bitch? No. Um, why not? Uh, because you love me. Oh, you're right. I'm so in love with you. You're actually amazing. If you ever need anything at all, anything, let me know. Great. Thank you. Please leave now. <laughs> uh, what the fuck was that? I think I found out what my new power does. <laughs> Dude, look at Angie over there with your ex. Already? I mean, he moved on pretty fast, but I guess he likes her. They hate each other. You're a cheater. Never <gasps> talk to me ever again. She just slapped him across the face. Was that because of you? Huh. I think I like this power even more. You should use it to get Mike to like you back. You're right. I'm going to do it. Hey, Mike. You're in love with me, right? Uh, absolutely not. No. What? Were you just trying to use your powers to get me to like you back? No.